everybody, and thanks for joining me here at the Techie Coach. Today, in this video, we're going to talk about how to import a range of information from one Google Sheet to another. Now, this is a concept that, if you're familiar with Excel, is pretty easy to do if you're working with sheets within the same workbook. But when you're using two different worksheets or, or two different sheets in Google, it can get a little tricky. And so I'm going to use this example here that I have. This is a sheet that comes from a Google form that I have set up for a workshop evaluation. And what I would like to do is I would like to have this column of information right here, these cells copied over into a different sheet as responses come into my Google Sheet. Now in order to do that, what you'll need to do is go ahead and set up a Google Sheet where you would like that information to go. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to click on this first cell right here and for the function, I'm going to enter import range. And you'll see that you'll have a little pop-up that tells you what an import range function is. This tells us that it's going to import data from another spreadsheet. Now the first thing that it needs you to provide is the key for the Google Sheet where we're going to pull this information from. And so what you're going to notice is that in the web address for any Google Doc you have, there is a section right after the main address that has a series of characters that identify that document. That's what we want. So I'm going to go over to the other sheet where I want to import that information from. I'll click on it here. And if I look in the address for this sheet, this is the identifier key for this sheet. So I'll highlight that and then right click and copy it. And I'm going to go back to the destination sheet where I want this information. And we need to set this off with a quotation mark. And then I'll paste in the key and then close that with quotation marks. And then I'm going to provide a comma because then after the key, then it wants us to tell where we're getting that data from in that sheet. In other words, what is the range of cells that we're going to copy from that sheet? And we'll also set that off with quotation marks. And then when I go back to this sheet, the information that I want is in this tab right here, form responses one. So I need to provide that information just as it's shown, form responses one. And then I'll end that with an exclamation mark. And then I need to tell it which range in that sheet. And so I actually want all the data from column G. But I'm going to tell it it's from G1 to G200. And that will allow me quite a bit of information as it comes into that sheet from my Google Form. So I'll say G1 colon G200. Close that with quotation marks. And then close parentheses and hit Enter. And so it's already there. Now you might see a reference value and if you click on that it will actually ask you if it can have access to that sheet. That's something that often happens and you just click allow access and then it will populate your column with that information as it's done here. So that's just a quick run through on how to import a range of information from one Google Sheet to another. I hope this is valuable to you and thanks for watching the Techie Coach.